And if you never know this, you better know it now. With your mama, Ojo, and there is no pizza. Now, Allah, Femi Femo, on one lap. Wow, ah, uh-uh. ah, ah, Femi. So, this is why you're spending company's money, right? Ah, sir. I mean, <laughs> look at your house, Femi. Oh, please. Come on, sir. Wow, wow, wow. This is absolutely nothing yeah. compared to the littlest of your villa. No, go ahead, my turn, my turn. Please have your seat, sir. It's okay, it's okay. <laughs> wow, 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 wow. Femi. Ah. Hey, yeah, how, how is your wife? Oh, she's fine. She stepped out not long ago. Oh, great, great. And then your your son, that, that vibrant young man. They stepped out together. Oh, great, great. I see, I see, I see. Whew. Wow. Ah. Femi. Yes, sir. Mm. The time has come. Time for what, sir? Femi, the time is now and I am sick. Sick? Yes. Sir, you don't look sick. Femi, if 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 you look at me, don't don't you see changes in my body? Well? Uh? I think your dark hair days are over. It's the grey era now. <laughs> I mean, well, not to skip that, but I mean, waking up every morning to just appreciate the beauty of grey, right? One cannot <laughs> cannot skip that away, right? But ah, tell me, came up for time. I am sick. Yeah, hey, hey, no, come on, come on, no, don't don't feel pity for me. That's that's not why I'm here. All life must come to an end, right? That's the life we live in. I'm sorry, sir. Come on, this is not a sorry party, you know, to be saying goodbye to each other. If at all, Femi, eh? We're not with me now. I've lived a good life. Eh? Mm. What about the company? That's a very good question. Mm? If there's anybody I can entrust the company to, eh? It has to be you, Femi. Yes, Femi, it has to be you because if there's anyone I can trust with building and operating the legacy of that complaint, it has to be you, Femi. Thank you, uh, sir. Uh, you see, go, go, go talk well. But I must be honest with you, there is something. What is it, sir? Unfortunately, according to the laws of the complaint, before I can hand over ownership unto you, uh, Femi, your son has to be legally married. My son? Yes, Femi, your son. Mm. He has to be legally married, but to my daughter. What? Eh, uh, Benny. <laughs> Shocking, Abby. I was expecting that. You see, Femi, I am only telling you this because that is the only time and condition I have to transfer the ownership of the complaint to you. But, sir, mm. I can't force my son to marry your daughter. Benny, Femi, I know. I know you cannot force him. I'm only telling you the time and condition. It's not left for you to know what to do. Sure, you feel me? Think about it as soon as possible and get back to me. Hmm? Okay, sir. Do. Uh, feel me? Uh, you always done the right thing, feel me? Hmm? It should not be an exception. Hmm? Cook with me. Why? 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 Just why? Why? Why does he have to bring this particular term and condition for the handover? Well, I guess it's the law binding the company. And I do not think there's anything we can do about it. You know how important this company is to me. But this term, this condition, it's impossible. Impossible? Femi, you have to be positive. We have not even spoken to our son yet. Speak to him about what? Marriage? You know that is not possible. Why is it not possible? Is he not old enough to get married? Oh, because it's the same time you got married, right? Femi, times are different. So is the dispensation. Interesting. Times are truly different. The last thing I want to do is force my son into marriage. Because of some selfish gains. Femi, we are not going to force our son into marriage. First, we are going to talk to him about it. 
then we're going to explain the situation and then ask him if he's willing to do it. Talk to him about it. You know what? I do not want to involve myself in any of this. If you want to speak to him, please, by all means, do. Ah! Acting like he's not desperate to have the company. And if you never know this, you better know it now. With your mama, Ojo, and there is no pizza. Now I laugh. Ojo? You didn't hear me knock. I've been knocking for the past 20 minutes. What? What are you doing? Mama, you've been knocking for 20 minutes. Why didn't you just force yourself in as usual? I mean, it's not like I have privacy in this house. But that is why I was knocking. Because you're no longer a child. Those little privacy. You deserve them. Maybe you should go back and knock again. I wait for me to shout, Mama, enter! Before entering. Should we try it? Shut up, Joe. Ojo, all your mates are getting married. You're supposed to be married yourself. You're not getting any younger. Mama, all my mates, in which country? Angola or Zimbabwe? Mama, you of all people, you're talking about marriage to me. You won't even let me talk to a girl, let alone have a girlfriend, or even get married. And you're talking to me about marriage, Mama. See. I have accepted my fate that I might not even get married till I pass away. God forbid! I forbid it in Jesus' name. Why would he say something like that? Why? The evidence are written in the sky for all to see, Mama. No, now. Why would he say something like that? You're a very special boy. Man. And that is why I don't like you talking to all these random girls. You deserve a special woman because of how special you are, Ojo. Really? Interesting. Well, if that's the case, I think I have someone special. Who? Where? When? How? You better be joking. Anyway, have you eaten? Nope. You have not eaten? That's not fair. Okay, you know what? I'm going to prepare something very special for you. Mama, this one you are very nice to me today. Am I safe? Or should I start packing my loads? Loads to where? Ojo, you're no longer a child. And I think it's high time we start treating you as someone who is about to start his own family. Mama, I don't understand. Don't worry. You will understand soon. If you need anything, let me know, okay? Enjoying your food? Of course, Mama. As always. I pray your wife will be able to cook just like me. My wife? Yes. Because the only thing some girls, especially girls of nowadays, can do is to do TikTok, post on Instagram, and, and chat Snap. Snapchat. Snapchat. Whatever. But Mama, what is all these marriage talks? Don't you know you'll soon get married? You're no longer a child. Get married? Daddy? Mama Ojo, please, not now. Allow the boy eat his food in peace. Okay, oh. Okay, yeah, oh. <laughs> Yeah.
you are playing FIFA. When I was your age, I don't think anyone loved playing FIFA as much as I did back then in 1993 when the first FIFA video game came out. So, Daddy, what happened? Why did you stop? Life happened. You get married and everything starts to change. You get married soon, my boy, and all of this won't matter anymore. Daddy, you too? What's going on? Why is everyone talking to me about marriage? Or is there something you're not telling me? Well, the truth is, you're not getting any younger. Daddy, I am in my early 20s. If there's anything I could change, it would be getting married early and on time. Daddy, that's not true. A lot of people will say if they could change anything, they would enjoy their youthful age longer before getting married. And you're telling me the complete opposite. People see life differently. For me, I wish I got married earlier. Well, as for me, I want to enjoy my youthful age. I do not want to get married anytime soon. And daddy, please, enough of this marriage talks. Please. Look, I am not forcing you. I am only advising you as my son. Thank you, daddy. Enjoy your game while you still can. What's all this marriage talks? Like, I don't understand. Come on, have your seat. Okay. Hold on a second. Mama, Daddy, please come downstairs. Are you okay? Yes, I am. Just a little bit nervous. Don't worry. My parents have been dying to meet you. Look good. Thank you. Good morning, sir. Good morning. Good good morning, ma. Good morning. Mama, Daddy, this is Josephine. She's my girlfriend. We've been dating for like three years now. Daddy, Mama, what's wrong? You both have been talking to me about marriage lately. So I thought to introduce my girlfriend to you. And now you both are keeping quiet. You're welcome, Josephine. Thank you very much, sir. Ojo, why didn't you tell her? Tell her what, Mama? That you both can't get married. What? Mama, I don't understand. Mama Ojo. Tell me, stop. Hey! This boy knows he can't get married to her. And he brought her to this house. Ha! Such disrespect. O Ojo, Ojo, what is going on? Please, calm down. Mama, what are you saying? What's going on? You know very well we are not a polygamous family. So why did you bring a second wife to this house? Yes! How dare you? Second wife? Wait, Ojo, so you are married? He is married. How can I be married for God's sake? I am not married, Josephine. So your mom is lying on you? Exactly. He thinks I'm lying on him. Ask his father. Whatever he says is the truth. Good. My father never lies. He will never lie on me. Tell me, has Ojo been married before? Yes or no? Ah! Yes. Ha! Yes. 
Wow. Yeah! Oh, Lua! Just... Mm. Don't follow me and don't you ever call my phone again. Really? No, really? What exactly is going on in this house? This is someone I suffered before she agreed to date me. Three years down the drain, that's what you've done. You broke us up in one swoop. What have I done to deserve all this? Is this how good parents do? Shut up your mouth before I shut it for you. And sit down. I am not sitting down. And I am not shutting up. Yes. We lied about you being married because we had the reason to. Femi, talk to your son. Firstly, I want to apologize for lying. It is your mother that is pushing all this. What are you saying? Is that what I asked you to tell him? Ojo, the thing is, my company CEO is very sick and he wants to transfer the ownership of his company to me. But he can't do it unless unless my son is is legally married but that is why i brought my girlfriend for proper introduction legally married to his daughter what his daughter yes ah. so this is why i'm being preached to about marriage and what not every single day you want me to get married to someone I do not know anything about? Or for what? Your selfish gain? Look, son, it's okay to refuse it. I won't force you to do what you do not want to do. But remember, your father's company is also your company. Just think about it. How old is she? I think she's... Um... In her early 20s. Yes, in her early 20s. Is she beautiful? Very! She's one of the most beautiful creatures on planet Earth. Can I see a picture? <laughs> of course. Why not? I'll just uh, drop it to you. Well, she's not, she's not looking bad. She's actually beautiful. Uh -huh. Of course, she is. And she has money. Stinking rich. She's the daughter to the CEO of your father's company. Remember? The same company that will be mine, yours, ours. The moment the both of you are legally married. Okay. No problem. I'll marry her. Let's do this. Uh -huh. That's my son. Ojo, are you sure you really want to do this? Well, if she's everything you've said, then why not? What else is a man looking for in a wife? My son is already calling himself a man. This I love to hear. She's everything we have said. And even more. No doubt. Then, let's go. When is the preparation starting? As soon as possible. We can as well have the wedding this Saturday. This Saturday? That's in three days. Is that not too early? I don't think so. We might as well wake up to someone snatching her from us tomorrow morning. I hate the virtualities. Saturday is fine then. All right then. Let the preparation begin. Hey! <laughs> My son is about to get married. <laughs>
Amen. 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 These two are here today to be joined together in a holy matrimony with God as a witness alongside the family and the friends. It is our joy that our son has found our daughter and they have both agreed to be together forever and ever. You are who? What is it? I was supposed to be getting married to the daughter and not to the mother. I am the daughter. What are you talking about? You are supposed to be in your early 20s. Oh, come on. Are you a boy? I'm in my 30s. <laughs> oh, so you want to take over my father's company and you don't want to do whatever it takes. Amen. Amen. Where's the ring? The ring, please. Genesis chapter 2, verse 24 says, Therefore shall a man leave his father and his mother, and shall cleave unto his wife, and they shall be one flesh. Take this ring. Take. Mr. Ojo Asubi Ojo, do you take Miss Gina Omoto as your lawfully wedded wife? I do. Miss Gina Omoto, do you take Mr. Ojo? Absolutely, yes. <laughs> My husband. I hereby pronounce you both as husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. information I am now your lawfully wedded wife so come to me baby boy who is your baby it's giving more sugar mommy than the wife that's your business our honeymoon has just started so don't keep your wife waiting come to me honey who is your honey I said come here don't let me come there and get you and what will you do are you my mommy you will soon find out baby boy come to me Come to mommy. Daddy! Mama!
Where are my parents? They've gone to see my father. <laughs> Where's my food? Where is my food? Down here. I hear me, to me, by me. And it was delicious. Now, see this place. Take them to the kitchen and wash up the dishes. First of all, Oh Joe, what is it? Why did you badge in like that? I want a divorce. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I am not a comedian. The both of you are now seeing me as a clown. Oh Joe, what God has joined together, no man can put asunder. No, Mama. God did not join this one together. The both of you did. Ojo, all marriages have their ups and downs. When I first got married to your mom, things were hard. But look at us now. Look at us. Daddy, that one is your business. But you see this marriage? This marriage scam. I am not interested in it anymore. Just try to be patient. I said I am not doing again. What part of I am not doing again do you both not understand? Hey, baby. I've been waiting for you in the wrong sense. Who is your baby? I am not your baby. Go and look for your baby elsewhere. Mr. Femi, does your son know what he's really into? Um, Gina, please, take it easy on him. You know he's still young. I'm not used to stuff like this. You didn't know he was young before you agreed to the contract. It is your greed that made you trade your son for my father's company and I am going to use him as I want. Duzu, you're not going to use me. Now, Ojo, come with me. Your service is needed. I am not coming with you. Mama? Ojo? Mama? Ojo? Mama? Ojo? Mama? Ojo? Mama? What is wrong with you? What kind of sleep is that? Wait, Mama. Am I married? Married? At what age? What kind of stupid question is that? So I'm not married. Ah, thank God. It was all a dream. Will you get up and go and have your bath? Your father's CEO at his company is here. And he didn't come alone. He came with his daughter, Gina, for a court visit. So if you like, dress anyhow. You will see what I will do to you. Quickly! Nobody go walk. No, 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 no. You know, say aeroplane, why, why do you want to take off? He go put in wings. <laughs> 